Well, good evening to you and welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football to which we look forward immensely. It's hardly a surprise that everybody has come here in their droves, this being a fixture that has received so much coverage in the days leading up to it. And it's good to see that we have a good contingent of visiting fans by the look of it too. The atmosphere is amicable, the conditions do bring out the best in everyone, and I think we're all looking forward to a feel-good game. We're being met here by this wall of Catalan noise, 100,000 or so supporters singing in unison, and boy, it is some racket here. Things have got underway here pretty promptly. Kunde. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Robert Lewandowski. He's just about the perfect all-round striker. Not least because he can finish equally well with both feet, Peter. It's not all about his finishing, though. He's always on the shoulder, looking for that ball in behind. And that prevents the opposition defence from getting too high or, indeed, getting too comfortable. Goes in for the header! Now, who's going to be first to this? Oh, just needed a better contact. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases your chances of the ball being met like that by someone. Tries to get it clear. Back when it goes. Shapes the shoot! And now they can spring out of defence. De Jong. Oh, good spread. Sergio Roberto picks it up out wide. Climbs up big! It's him! Well, once more, it's him. And we can't be surprised because his instinct for doing this is incredible. It was a great header. The invitation was irresistible and the finish unerring. Well, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. Barcelona make the perfect start. They are already ahead. Moved on forwards. Now it's Gundogan. Gavi. Sergio Roberto kept his eye on it, and he's there. De Jong. Played out to the left flank. Gavi. Decent hit! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Gavi has taken on too much there. That isn't one of the areas he thrives on. Well time, excellent interception. Gavi. Barcelona are very much in charge here. Dominating possession and a goal to the good. Oh, it's played into the area. And they can counter here. And that interception was most necessary. Kunde. Thinks one through. And here's Sergio Roberto. He's had a hit! Sticks it away! Two up and threatening to pull clear! Even some of the opposing fans are clapping that. You just have to appreciate it. Oh, that's a measured delight. The curly applied was immaculate. So that's two now without reply. We're looking at a very different game now. The command has been established. 
Can he latch on to this? And he's onside. Chance to shoot now. De Jong. So, what can they make of this? Well seen, saw that coming. Kunde. And it's Sergio Roberto. Romeu. Spread out to the left. Strong running down that left flank. Gavi. Turns and goes back. Romeu driving forwards. Well, the defence proved infallible then, but that won't be the last they'll see of him. Balda. Barcelona looking forward to the break after some very good work in the first 45 minutes. And that's aimed into the middle. And he's taking no chances there. And the counter is on. That's a modern defender's instinct from a, a modern coach's mindset. And he cuts out the supply. Now it's Lewandowski. He's tried one! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Really was just waiting to pounce on any slip up and he was gifted a chance. Looking for the runner. Forwards and with intent. Oh, really good feet. Over okay. to the other side. Gavi. Gavi! It's off target and by quite a way. Yeah, they've got away with it, but that was a, a defensive letdown to see him march through like that. And the referee brings the first half to a close. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Barcelona sitting pretty here at half-time, 2-0 up. Already up and running for the second half. Changes made by neither side, from what we understand. And he's in on goal! Hits one! Well, the finish certainly didn't match the build-up. It was such a clever idea to lift it into his path. Alda. Gavi. Not in the one. No, he's not getting his way this time. Defenders on the back foot. He's got away. So much time and space here. He's got the shot away. It's a goal. The second half off to a spectacular start. Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with, and to find it, I think it was a fine drive, and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that. I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance. Colo Colo get themselves back into contention. Well, I think they probably needed an early goal in this half just to give them the confidence and belief to push on and look for an equaliser. perhaps deserves a little bit of sympathy here because that's a goalkeeper's nightmare. It's, it's clear that the keeper was unsighted by his defence and by the time he picked up the flight of that, it was too late. So the lead now is two. Look, it's a whole different ball game now, Peter, and it's a test of how they manage affairs from here.
certain amount of room for debate here, but a goal kick's been given. Gavi. Yeah, we get to see this more and more. Defenders popping up in these positions. Gets to show off his quick feet. De Jong! Fair attempt, just the wrong outcome. Ball's gone out of play. De Jong. Played out to the right. And it's Kunduan. Gavi. Plays it in low. And here comes the corner. Have their second corner now. Defending of the desperate variety. Fires it in low. Crossed it again. He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. Gundogan. De Jong. Looking for options for movement. Played into the middle. And through to the goalkeeper. Now oh, they could break here. But it is clear to see that he is not at all happy with that. Yeah, the idea was right, the delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Lewandowski. Takes on his marker. And it's Romeu. And he's had a hit! And that would have won it. Well, that ought to have wrapped it up, Peter. He may well regret that, you know. Gavi. Gavi plays in with a header. They are rampant. And they are cruising away. Yeah, they've only got themselves to blame. Mistakes in those areas are very punishable. Barcelona blast themselves into a three-goal lead. Out to the right. Gundogan. Played out towards the right wing, and he was quick to react. Gently done. Niceties are not... Well, that's surely a foul free kick. There's a sharp little ball here, and the flag... Can he put it away? And that is wildly off target. Oh, it's a brilliant effort, you have to say that. He clearly wanted to do it in style. He's having a go! Oh, that is rather wayward. Well, talking about playing into your opponent's hands, that kind of thing is not going to get them back into this game. Balda. Oh, good spread. Gundogan. Now, who's going to be first to this? 
Defenders on the back foot. Skillfully cut out. He is so at ease on the ball. Sergio Roberto, a massive creative influence involved in so many goals. Now that looks a decent ball. He's left his man. Time added on four minutes. The pass has gone astray. Romeo. Gavi. And there's his chance to lead the counter. Oh, he's bustling through here. He's away. Oh, just... He's going for goal. And that is the last effort of the game. Oh, a great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. Gavi taking in the accolades, having been named.